And now let's review and practice a bit. Remember that we use to give something up or to give up doing something when you indicate that you stop doing something, especially something that you do regularly. Now read the sentence below and fill in the blank using the appropriate phrasal verb. July hurt studies because she ran out of money. July gave up her studies because she ran out of money. Also remember that we use to give up on somebody or something when you stop hoping that someone or something will change or improve. Now read the sentence below and fill in the blank using the appropriate phrasal verb. Mike was ready to his relationship with Sarah as she wasn't supportive enough. Mike was ready to give up on his relationship with Sarah as she wasn't supportive enough. Note that we use to give yourself up to something when you allow yourself to feel an emotion completely without trying to control it. Now read the sentence below and fill in the blank using the appropriate phrasal verb. Never sadness. Stay positive. Never give yourself up to sadness. Stay positive. Remember that we used to turn out when something happens in a particular way or has a particular result, especially one that you did not expect. Now read the sentence below and fill in the blank using the appropriate phrasal verb. Kate thought she would spend her B-Day alone, but it that her friends had planned a surprise B-Day party for her. Kate thought she would spend her B-Day alone, but it turned out that her friends had planned a surprise B-Day party for her. Also remember that we used to turn out for when a lot of people go to watch the event or take part in it. Now read the sentence below and fill in the blank using the appropriate phrasal verb. I think that the whole city celebration. I think that the whole city turned out for the celebration.